Hi guys and welcome to Wild and Beard Reviews. Tonight we're talking about Arrow, Season 6, Episode 22, The Ties That Bind. And we will be talking about spoilers, so if you haven't had a chance to check this one out, do so before you finish this video so you don't get anything spoiled for you. Now, um, overall, um, I enjoyed this episode, but it did feel like the show was spinning its wheels a little bit. So, uh, the episode opens with all of our, our main cast members, all of our char main characters, you know, having, you know, uh, a nice night in, right? We've got uh, Oliver Queen and Felicity and William having breakfast for dinner. We've got uh, Renee and his daughter watching hockey. We've got Curtis and uh, his boyfriend Nick having, um, you know, a, a night out to themselves. All kinds of, everyone just having a quiet night after the trial from last episode. And then, of course, it's Arrow. Things go wrong and uh, Ricardo Diaz launches an attack on all of our heroes and they have to scramble to get uh, get to safety to, to save themselves. Um, all tr being triggered by a message from uh, Anatoly warning Oliver right before it happens. Um, so I, I liked all of that. So I liked the stuff with Anatoly. I think it's cool that Anatoly has come back around. I think it was two episodes ago or so that we saw Anatoly's shift in thinking on on Ricardo Diaz. He realizes he's not an honorable, honorable man, um, so he's kind of swinging back towards helping Oliver, or he's somewhere in the middle, but right now he is siding more towards with Oliver. Um, as always, Arrow had some incredible action in this episode. The uh, all the opening scenes were great. The, there was a fight scene in uh, in the street around like a big uh, police van. There was a fight in the police station. Um, there was a fight in uh, the the new team Arrow's bunker. All of that was great. Um, what I think this episode uh, kind of fell apart on is the the premise of. Um, well, they, they want to get Ricardo Diaz, and so they set up a thing, and they, they fail to get him. Curtis gets hurt really bad, um, and then they realize that Ricardo Diaz wears a USB around his neck. They're like, okay, that must be important. Let's get uh, Felicity's digital sniffer thing to techno babble whatever to go to go get the information off of there. And so they send Lila into uh, the police headquarters and... Side note, can Lila be a series regular? Because she is great. I love that actress. I love that character. I love it when her and John are are a couple and they're doing awesome things together. I would love that. I know the cast is already overstuffed, but if you could take a self couple subtractions and add Lila, aces. Anyway, so they send Lila into the police station. Um, she gets caught. Uh, there's a big shootout there. They get the you know, the copy of the stuff that was on the, the USB drive. Felicity's trying to decrypt it, but they get attacked and they end up losing it. So it felt like a chunk of this episode was spent on getting the thing and then decrypting the thing, but then we lost the thing. So we don't get, didn't get anything out of any of that. And then it felt a little fillery, especially for the episode right before the season finale. There was a lot of good action around all of that. There were some good character moments around um, all of that. So all in all, I still enjoyed the episode, but I feel like that part of the plot was a little bit of, okay, we got two episodes before the season finale when it really could have been more like an hour and a half versus two hours of, of television. So uh, just give me a real quick video tonight. Those are my quick thoughts on this episode of Arrow. Um, but let me know what you thought in the comments below. Did you, uh, what did you think about this episode? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Uh, what are you looking forward for in the season finale? What do you want from next season? Let me know in the comments below. If this is your first time here at the channel, hit that subscribe button. Uh, and until next time, we'll see you at the cinema.